Okay, so I'm gonna start a new series. I'm um, looking forward to it. It's a bio, it's a bioware game, a very old bioware game, because uh, it's been a while since I've seen that used as their logo, their uh, and logo animation. Um, Microsoft Studios. No, I'm joking. That's not the game. Um, uh, it's very. I I like this game. I like this whole series of this of uh, this uh, franchise. It's a very good game. I love it. Mass Effect. Yep, I'm playing it. Um, all the games I'm basically playing now, right now, are like games that could easily turn go from like a, a twenty episode part, depending on whether I know what I'm doing, to fifty to sixty parts. Um, resume. Now I'm going to start a new campaign, Welcome mate. To Alliance military database. Thank you. Classified information requested. I don't understand why you have to do that. Connect to the the server or whatever. Um, I'm going to try and be Secure getting some achievements during this playthrough. Uh, the engineer achievements, basically. Uh, I'm not going to fuck with, with the awesome John, John, uh, John Shepard. Um, I'm going to select existing. No, I'm just going to go as John Shepard. <laughs> fuck it. Um, his name's not going to be, yeah, his name's going to be John, though, because I'm not going to put my real name. Oh, uh, Bonus. But I want. Wait, does that make me a soldier if I pick John Shepard? I can't remember. We'll find out. If we find out um, the hard way, I'm gonna have to restart the, just restart the anime first bit again, which without a doubt will probably get cut. Um, I forgot to start the timer again. Uh, I'm gonna go with. Singularity, because I like it. Complete. Yep, I thought it would. No, I'm not being a fucking soldier. Back the fuck out. Um, new ID. Um, quick start mail, why not? Um, John, yeah. Log in to access your profile. Singularity. Profile I, was... I want... I want... The, the, the class, you know, where where is the class? I think it must, it must be custom mail then. Please log in to access your profile. It is custom. Fuck me. I thought it was. I wanted to get it all over and done with. God damn it. Decrypting. All right. Yes. Yeah, so this must be where I can pick Warning. my class. Data corruption detected. Man, I love I love this game, but <laughs> I'm already getting fucked over in the first like five Please minutes. Yeah, let's reconstruct this profile. Okay, uh, this is what this is the uh, screen I wanted. I didn't think I had to do all that shit earlier. Um, spacer, colonist, or Earthborn. I'm gonna be a colonist. I like colonists. Joking, colonists suck. We're gonna be a spacer. Spacers are awesome. Uh, I'm gonna be the war hero. Confirm military And. I want the achievements for engineer, but fucking Vanguard and Sentinel are top. But I'm gonna be engineer. Um, bonus talent. Assault rifles, just because it's so much helpful. Yeah, that'll do. Yeah, that's good. Confirm. Identification confirmed. Nah. <laughs> um, no. Normal. Or better. Normal. Or better. Oh, better, better. No, yes, yes. Um, sure, why not? Um, yeah, good. We're good to go. So yeah, everyone loves the begin when I start the series, and like they see like the first five or ten minutes is just me setting everything up. <laughs> they love it for some reason. I can't imagine why. Loading. I will be silent for his cutscene, so. Well, what about Shepard? Spacer lived aboard starships most of his life. Military service runs in the family. Both his parents were in the Navy. He proved himself during the Blitz. Held off enemy forces on the ground until reinforcements arrived. He's the only reason Elysium is still standing. We can't question his courage. Humanity needs a hero. And Shepard's the best we've got. I'll make the call. In the year two 
the 2100 Voyager explorers on Mars discovered the remains of an ancient spacefaring civilization in the decades that followed. These mysterious artifacts revealed startling new technologies enabling travel to the furthest stars. The basis of, for this incredible technology was a force that controlled the fabric of time. There, 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 there. Mass Effect! There you go. That's all you needed to know out of that whole thing. Mass Effect. The best of one of the best characters. I say one of the best because there's some pretty good voice actors in this, in this series, in anyway. By that, I mean two. There's only two I really care about. One of them you're about to meet now, and the one you'll meet soon enough. <laughs> Thrusters, check. Navigation, check. Internal emissions sync engaged. All systems online. Drift, just under 1500k. There's one of them. 1500 uh, is he's good. He's not him, sorry. Your captain will be pleased. It's the other one. Him, yeah. I Joker, the best. No, Nihilus gave you a compliment. So you hate him. You remember to zip up your jumpsuit on the way out of the bathroom? That's good. I just jumped us halfway across the galaxy and hit a target the size of a pinhead. So that's incredible. <laughs> Besides, specters are trouble. I don't like having them on board. Oh! Call me paranoid. You're paranoid. The Council helped fund this project. They have a right to send someone to keep an eye on their investment. Yeah, that is the official story. Only an idiot believes the official story. They don't send specters on shakedown runs. So there's more going on here than the captain's letting off. I won't skip the Joker. conversations, by the way. That is report. Oh, there's the other one. <laughs> Just cleared the mass relay, Captain. The two Stealth best. systems engaged. Everything looks solid. Good. Find a comm buoy and link us into the network. I want mission reports relayed back to Alliance Brass before we reach Eden Prime. Aye, aye, Captain. Better brace yourself, sir. I think Nihilus is headed your way. He's already here. Tell Commander Shepard to meet me in the comm room for a debrief. Idiot. <clears throat> you get that, Commander? He sounds angry. Something must have gone wrong with the mission. <laughs> Captain always sounds like that when he's talking to me. Can't possibly imagine why. <laughs> yeah, go fuck yourself, Caden. Joke is where it's at. Um. <laughs> oh, let's explore. Joking, I'm not going to explore. I'm just going straight to the mission. Navigator Presley. I'm not going to speak to you. I'm too good for you. <laughs> Jenkins! Nihilus. So where's Anderson? Commander Shepard, I was hoping you'd get here first. It will give us a chance to talk. The captain said he'd meet me here. He's on his way. I'm interested in this world we're going to. Eden Prime. I've heard it's quite beautiful. They say it's a paradise. Yes, a paradise. Serene, tranquil, safe. Eden Prime has become something of a symbol for your people, hasn't it? Proof that humanity can not only establish colonies across the galaxy, but also protect them. But how safe is it, really? Do you know well, something? I don't know. <laughs> your people are still newcomers, Shepard. The galaxy can be a very dangerous place. Is the Alliance truly ready for this? No. I think it's about time we told the commander what's really going on. This mission is far more than a simple shakedown run. I figured there was something you weren't telling us. We're making a covert pickup on Eden Prime. That's why we needed the stealth systems operational. There must be a reason you didn't tell me about this, sir. This comes down from the top, commander. 
Information strictly on a need-to-know basis. A need-to-know. A research team on your arrival. need to know. Unearthed some kind of beacon during an excavation. <laughs> it was Prothean. Prothean? I thought the Protheans vanished 50,000 years ago. Their legacy still remains. The mass relays, the citadel, our ship drives. It's all based on Prothean technology. This is Big Shot. The last time humanity made a discovery like this, it jumped our technology forward 200 years. Our Prime doesn't 200 have the facilities years. to handle something like this. We need to bring the beacon back to the citadel for proper study. Nah, just bring Obviously, it back to us. This goes why, beyond why the citadel? interest, Commander. This discovery could affect every species in Council space. It never hurts to have a few extra hands on board. The beacon is not the only reason I'm here, Shepard. Nihilus wants to see you in action, Commander. He's here to evaluate you. Guess that explains why I bump into him every time I turn around. The Alliance has been pushing <laughs> for this for a long time. Uh. Humanity wants a larger role in shaping interstellar policy. We want more say with the Citadel Council. The Spectres represent the Council's power and authority. If they accept a human into their ranks, it shows how far the Alliance has come. Hey, hey. You held off an enemy assault during the Blitz single-handed. You showed not only courage, but also incredible skill. That's why I put your name forward as a candidate for the Spectres. I assume this is good for the Alliance. Earth he just said it. Why was that Earth even an option? I don't even know why it was an option. I need to see your skills for myself, Commander. Eden Prime will be the first of several missions together. Haha. <laughs> You'll be in charge of the ground team. Oh, will it? Secure the beacon and get it onto the ship ASAP. Nihilus will accompany you to observe the mission. Protheans! What do you know about the Protheans? Just what they taught us in school. They were a technologically advanced species that ruled the galaxy 50,000 years ago. Then they vanished. I wonder Nobody why. Nobody really knows how or why, though I've heard plenty of theories. But everyone agrees galactic civilization wouldn't exist without them. Their citadel is the very heart of galactic society. And without their mass relays, interstellar travel would be impossible. We all owe the Protheans a great debt. <laughs> Do we, though? Do we? Just give the word, Captain. We should be getting close to Eden. Captain, we got a problem. Oh, What's no! Wrong? Transmission from Eden Prime, sir. You better see this. Bring it up on screen. I love how they don't have this room in any other Mass Effect game for the ship. This is the only game that has this room for the ship. Get down! Oh no! It's Ashley. I don't know who she could be. We are under attack, taking heavy casualties. I repeat, heavy casualties. We can't get evac. They came out of nowhere. We need. Random officer with no name. Oh, they're all staring to the sky. Oh my god. Everything cuts out after that. No calm traffic at all. It just goes dead. There's nothing. There's nothing. Reverse and hold the 38.5. Status report. 17 minutes out, Captain. No other Alliance ships in the area. Ah, oh, no Take more. We're the only ones. Point. God damn. This mission just got a lot more complicated. Well, <laughs> a small strike team can move quickly without drawing attention. Hell That's yeah. Our best chance to secure the beacon. The small strike teams are Grab always the best strike teams. the cargo teams. hold. Tell Elenko and Jenkins to suit up, Commander. You're going in. Now I'm gonna try not to skip conversations. I nearly fucking skipped half that conversation. I was like so close to pressing the X button because that's the skip button for Xbox. Oh, I was panicking. I was like, no, nope, don't skip it. Don't skip it. Doing some serious digging here, Captain. Your team's the muscle in this operation, Commander. Go in heavy and head straight for the dig site. <laughs> what about survivors, Me Captain? Me and uh, Caden and Helping Leroy Jenkins will is go a secondary on. objective. I don't. Actually, I think he is priority. actually meant to be. I think his, uh, uh, the initial for his first name is L, I'm pretty sure. You're coming with us? I move faster and on my own. the screen. So yeah, Not I told you, ahead. if you uh, didn't you watch my table part the that I, Otherwise, I want uploaded radio the other day, um, I mentioned that my screen fucks up a lot. Yeah, I just did that now, so that's why it's taken me an option a while. 
to uh, pick an option because uh, I didn't see the screen and it's just done it again. It hates Mass Effect games. It does it the most whenever I play a Mass Effect game, I swear. I was playing Mass Effect 2 the other day, like the other week, just um, getting back back to the use of the abilities and stuff for this game. And it did it again. I was really annoyed. I don't know why it is. Um, so where's Jenkins? Yeah, Richard. Oh, Richard L. Jenkins. Richard Leroy Jenkins. There you go. Alright, so I'm the engineer, I guess. Yes, I am. Good. Okay, I don't think I get to use ability straight. Oh no, I must be able to. Three points. Um, I don't want pistols. Um, yeah, this is like ridiculously annoying at times. Um, hacking. Decryption. They want decryption. Electronics. Engineer, why not? There we go. Of course, I can do it for Caden. You don't want to do it for him. It's a waste of time putting upgrades into this guy. Um, barrier. There we go. What the? I don't know what could possibly have happened here. I mean, we all saw the video. What? What is this? <laughs> okay. It's so quiet. <gasps> what was that noise? And there's Jenkins dead. I've lost shields. God damn, it's been so long since I played the first one. Investigate. Oh, he's dead. Oh no. Ripped right through his shields. I ran a chance. We'll see that he receives a proper service once the mission is complete. But I need you to stay focused. Aye, aye, sir. Level up. I'll do all the level ups at the end of the mission. I'm not going to keep Swift going into the menus. <sighs> okay. What abilities do I have right now? Oh, yeah, you're going to see this menu wheel quite often. I have um, Sabotage and Overload. Okay. Just like now. You're going to see it quite often. Because I have all the DLC for all the Mass Effects, I was thinking of doing a series run through where I played all the Mass Effects, yeah. But I don't know whether I uh, to do the DLC or not, because I do also own all the DLC. Um, so maybe if I can be bothered, because all it will do is actually add like extra like 10 episodes, or 10 parts even, or probably 5 parts even per, ep per DLC. I don't know, depending on how long the DLC is that I do. Uh, Mass Effect 1 DLC, obviously not that long. There's only two two DLC for it. Um, each one adds like three missions each, so that's probably like four parts at max. I don't know. Depends how good I remember it. Um, I'm just exploring because something's about to happen. <gasps> it's Ashley Williams, another really annoying character in this in this first in this game. Uh oh. Oh no. The Geth, by the way, awesome fucking enemies. I don't care what anyone says. Great idea. Lovely enemies. Because I picked a class where uh, all the abilities only work really work against synthetics. So, robots. <laughs> there we go. My shield is really shit, I just noticed that. 
commander? How did you know I was a commander? Fuck you. Gunnery Chief Ashley Williams of the 212. You the one in charge here, sir? Are you wounded, Williams? A few scrapes and burns. Nothing serious. The others weren't so lucky. Oh, man. We were patrolling the perimeter when the attack hit. We tried to get off a distress call, but they cut off our communications. I've been fighting for my life ever since. Where's the rest of your squad? We tried to double back to the beacon, Dead. but we walked into an ambush. I don't think any of the others... I think I'm the only one left. Don't blame this yourself. Tall, Williams. You couldn't have done Obviously blame your fucking self. Yes, sir. We held our position as long as we could, until the Geth overwhelmed us. The Geth haven't been seen outside the Vale in nearly 200 years. Why are they here now? They must have I don't the know. Beacon. The dig site is Why? close, just over that rise. It might still be there. We could use your help, Williams. Aye, aye, sir. It's time for payback. Um, Geth! What else do you know about the Geth? Just what I remember from history class back in school. They're synthetics, non-organic life forms with limited AI programming, created by the Quarians a few centuries ago. They were supposed to be a source of cheap labor, but ended up turning on the Quarians and drove them into exile. Well, after that, they just kind of disappeared behind the Perseus Veil. Nobody's just, really heard much from them since. They just went... Whew, went... Never heard of again. Move out. Oh, I pressed X, but thank God it was only in one line. It was only the move out line. Whew. Yeah. Almost skipped a whole conversation. <laughs> Jokes, it was only one line. Let's run. Run. Oh, cover. Forgot about this. Oh, crouch. I forgot about that. Man. How how often will you see me uh, use the cover in this game? Probably not a lot. Uh, overload. Sp oh, that was really fast. Jesus Christ. Oh, that's a rock. Down. Am I crouched? I can't tell. Yes, I am crouched. Um... 